The Pacers have reached the back stretch. And they are underway. And right in the center, that's Johnny Walker stepping out early. Has the lead by three quarters of a length. Now a full length outside Laguna Beach. Really hustling. Laguna Beach going to take it there from Johnny Walker. Back third is, uh, is uh, Thunderfist, followed by Inform Fourth. A length and a half more now to Native Lightning. Beauty and the Beast is pacing sixth. And at the end, hello and goodbye in the early trailer is Fire in the Shark. Laguna Beach leads this group of top-notch claiming handicap pacers to the quarter in 27 even. And it's Laguna Beach now on the front stretch with the lead. It is uh, coming off a win last time out. Ron Pierce doing the driving tonight, trying to slow the pace down. Johnny Walker with the pocket trip there second, followed by Thunderfist coming off back-to-back -back wins. In form one last time. He's the four to five favorite staying on the inside fourth. And it's Native Lightning with Sears stepping out to the outside, uh, picking up that cover, firing the shark. Beauty and the Beast seventh and also to the outside hello and goodbye the half mile 57 and 3 30 and 3 second panel unhurried up here for Laguna Beach and now the pressure comes on the outside from Thunderfist and Tyler Buter within a half length of the lead and getting closer good trip worked out there for Johnny Walker in form has picked up the cover on the outside fourth just three lengths off the lead inside Beauty and a Beast saving ground filling in the gap there third over sixth is Native Lightning big gap to the two trailers hello and goodbye and fire in the shark Three quarters, 125 and 227 to four in the back stretch. And still Laguna Beach clinging to that lead. Outside Thunderfist, unrelenting here. In form, getting ready to go out three wide. Still there in the pocket. Johnny Walker at the top of the stretch. Slight lead for Laguna Beach. To the outside now. Coming up fast there is a Thunderfist. Far outside in form. It's still Laguna Beach. Slight lead to the inside. Johnny Walker. It's tight and it's <laughs> A gutty victory, I believe, for Laguna Beach. Going to be a photo right there at the end, but I think Laguna Beach outpaced Johnny Walker with Thunderfist third. Time of the mile, 154 and three-fifths. Jimmy, Jimmy B, I think you may be right on this one, but look at the six-horse Laguna Beach hanging in there, digging in for Ronnie Pierce along the inside. Johnny Walker with Larry Staubon for Kimberly Asher. Noses apart here at the wire. Looks like the six-horse Laguna Beach is just going to get up and nip the five. Six, five, four. Very tight for that fourth spot. 154 and three. Judges have posted the unofficial order of finish tonight's eighth race. Number six, Laguna Beach finished first. Number five, Johnny Walker finished second. Number four, Thunderfist finished third. Number one, Inform finished fourth. Unofficially, six, five, four, one in race number eight. And the unofficial winner of the eighth race was the six, Laguna Beach, a six year old brown gelding by Real Artist out of Witch Tree by Falcon Sealster, bred by Steve Stewart of Kentucky, Cario Stable of California. Owned by Howard Taylor, Penn Valley, Pennsylvania, Thomas Lazaro, Syracuse, New York, Dylan Davis, the trainer, Ron Pierce, doing the driving, Laguna Beach, 7-2, second choice on the board, his second consecutive win in this class since coming from the Meadowlands, and tonight had all kinds of pressure late, but somehow found a way. Second win in eight this year, 14th lifetime victory with career earnings now over $194,000, and a winning time in the off going of 154 and 3 fifths for the six, Laguna Beach.